All right, let's try this. Let's get this done. Jacob and Esau moment. They are strong early game, late game. They get kind of a hustle. Wow, I got a double item. Room. That's lucky. Uh, let's just do. Actually, let's switch this up. Let's do this, cause uh, Esau needs more health. A haunt fight with Jacob and Esau is actually kind of tough. These guys struggle against the haunt, in my opinion, because of the hitbox moment. Oh, like how was I supposed to dodge that? That's okay, it really doesn't matter for early floors. What matters is later on, we gotta get Angel Room, so we gotta find Soul Hearts. On is done for, we get a damage up. Sure, we give it to Esau. I can't touch that heart, I think it's too over the thing. I can really try. Oh! <laughs> and then we'll go. That was a little bit nasty by me. Okay, we have to really not get hit here. I might even put Esau in front just because he has a Soul Heart protecting him. Jacob does not. We gotta spawn this devil. Not because we want a devil, but because we uh, want the angel. Let's put Esau in front and just keep moving forward. We should be okay. I mean, we have damage. We have tears. I'm getting hit. That's it. But Esau got hit. That's okay. We're fine. That's what we were planning. I did find my devil room fairly early. Don't get hit here. It's gonna be kind of tough. This room's impossible. How did I not get hit? Holy. Now nah, I just gotta beat the boss. Good damage. I have no bombs for Wormwood. That's alright. Don't even worry about it. Terrifying. Terrifying. I'm dead. I should have I should have gotten hit. I did it. I can't believe it. That should have been the end for me, actually. We are a little lucky. Perfect. Give me a key. Give me a key. Yes! I don't even need to go to the shop anymore. Actually, I might as well. We can blow up the keeper and this at the same time. And new nothing. Never mind. We'll go. I suppose I might as well pick this up. I mean, it's not useful to me, but I uh, might as well. Oh, and a random blight item that is Aquarius. These are just good. Let's put Esau in front, just like last time. So if we have to take damage, hopefully it is Esau taking the damage. We want to save up money as well. That Here, I'll give Esau this. We don't need the Ankh. Um, because money will give us a ton of damage. So much that I'm will okay, I'm willing to do this. I was going to blow everything up, but now I'm interested. I don't need King Baby. Oh my lord, hold the phone. Who has more luck? Is it normal Esau that has more luck? I really want the blue map too. I think normal Esau has more luck, right? Naturally? I guess they have the same luck right now. Doesn't really matter. So we'll take this and we kind of have a synergy going right away. Oh, to fight the boss. Oh, I felt it coming. Okay, that sucks. Tough. It, it was a low chance to get an angel anyway. Let's just work on getting soul hearts. We'll try and farm for four more cents and then we'll be able to also get that soul heart and then we should be able to land ourselves an angel room on the next floor we have a curse room which gives us access to that for free because this is downpour 2 meaning we have flight on command so what i'm going to do i think is get the tinted rock in the secret room at the same time because the bomb for the secret room is next to a golden chest well not like that matters actually i have flight oh that's actually way better hold on Yoink. let's do this and then this and then leave Perfect, we got a soul heart for Jacob later. We got a ton of pills, which I'll just do, I guess. Wow! 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 <laughs> oh my sweet up, let's go! Treasure moment, contagion is cool. Um, doesn't really matter who takes this, I suppose. Super bandage, awesome. Double white fire, double death. Let's go to the curse room. Um, you know what, this actually is not the worst in the world. I can use one of my mantles to touch the, this? Okay. I was gonna use the other mantle to walk out, but I, I did it perfectly, so it's all right. Wow, contagion moment. The more floors we do, the better, because we, wow, we'll get more money, which will give us more damage, which will make it so we can clear rooms more often and make it so we get more angel rooms. This is actually a really good run. In, in like comparison to the Jacob and Esau runs that you really could have, the items that I, I have landed so far, Jesus Christ, I'm playing with the devil currently. Uh, this is actually good. I like this so far. In fact, we can even do something like this. Is there anything decent? Uh, I know my pills are just good in general, so I don't even know if I want that. It is on sale though, so I, I should take it. Anything extra? Deep pockets? Yes, please. And then maybe a little bit of a blow up moment. I will try to get Humbling Bundle, but a nickel did not spawn, so I don't know. I will definitely try though. Isn't options question mark better? Uh, I think as an item, yeah, yikes, I might die. But I think that Humbling Bundle will pay out more for me damage-wise because I have money plus power. I'm dead, by the way. That's three cents. I got it. I, I refuse to die now, actually. Holy. 
Very nice. Yeah, I think options is a better item overall, but humbling bundle will give me more value because I have the capacity to get 999 coins with money equals power, and I want to kind of build into that, you know what I mean? We did get the bomb that we needed for the potential angel room, which we are definitely getting, and I'm not coping. Rainmaker, uh, Jacob and Esau is unironically like not an easy fight. If you get hit by Rainmaker, as these characters don't, don't beat yourself up. It's very much a, a fight designed for one length of character. I'll pick it up with Jacob. I don't know. I got good stats, actually. We can go in here for one bomb if you place it correctly, which I didn't. Uh, I guess I'll just go then. Blood bombs. Oh, oh, I forgot how blood bombs even work. I just consider them an HP up. <laughs> it's not a big deal. It's okay. If anything, I need to make sure that I have no damage on this floor so we can guarantee ourselves an angel. Did I do this? I think I'm going to do this. This is going to be really tough because I can't tell where I am. Oh! I can officially confirm that I, I do not uh, agree with my decision making there. There we go. Humbling Bundle Keeper's head is going crazy. We're immediately just getting a ton of money and there's Deep Pockets doing its thing. We can blow this secret room up as well as that mushroom. We got a heart. Epic. We got a range down. But for Esau, it's a range up. Let's go. Damn, I didn't know how goaded blood bombs are, dude. I should be using these. I have infinitum bombs. Can you use the invuln frames from blood bombs to open this chest, I wonder? You can. So worth it. More than enough to go in here and get pill baggy. I don't think that's worth it. I don't really think pill baggy's ever worth it, even when you do have PhD. Not to mention only one of my characters has PhD. Pay to win is interesting too though. I, I should probably take that. And with the amount of money I have, we're good now. We can unlock everything. Uh, I think there's a way you can, it's really tough, but you can get every single one of these mushrooms with two bombs. So in theory, if I'm Jacob and Esau, I can get all of these with one. I just have to be precise. Huh. Nice! Nothing! That was actually kind of sick by me though. That was a little precise. Kind of proud. Angel. Yes! Give this to you because you need a soul heart. Ew. Wow. I mean, I suppose I do need an active item. Soul heart? No. Okay, I need to protect... <laughs> I need to protect Jacob, dude. He is struggling. Okay, we have a gluttony fight. I'd like a less than three so I can give that to Jacob. Because bro is uh, kind of struggling on the health front. Hey, there you go. There you go, dude. You have blue map. <laughs> Thanks. Appreciate it. Sometimes I forget. No! I'm not doing that. No, 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 no. I, I, like, I like Shard of Glass, even though it's controversial. I like Shard of Glass for every other character except Jacob and Esau specifically. Oh, hello. Beautiful. Uh, I'm not gonna use the bombs. I don't have enough speed to get in there and get out. So let's just touch this and get the key piece. And then we'll try and go for the seven soul hearts. And then we don't need to fight the second angel since we already have one key piece, which is perfect. We do have 170 coins with money equals power. Esau's going nuts. Oh, this is gonna be a hard fight. This is gonna be tough. I'll try. Plus we got like the worst active item ever. 12 room charge to spawn in a boss that lasts like one room. <laughs> I, I don't- I- I'm kind of... I'm an idiot. Classic? What do you mean classic, dude? Pay to win. Um, that's just a decent item. Nothing crazy. Boom. Purity! Hello, beautiful. You gave me a goddamn spade up. Which actually isn't bad. I have 200 coins, by the way. <laughs> I don't- this is kind of nuts. We can blow up this keeper and go into the curse room and not blow myself up for once. Oh, the spiders. The, 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 the spiders. Soul hearts. Oh my god, epic. Actually, unironically. Saved? Real? Potentially? Hey Matt, you like Overwatch, right? Thoughts on the PvE fiasco. The fact that they're charging $15 to play the PvE, which isn't even the full PvE that they promised, and I thought that I would play it for free because I bought the watch point back, which is 40 bucks, but they're still making me pay money. <laughs> I hate it. I kept deal chance. I can go in here, technically, I have the key piece. That's good. That's just, I mean, that's good. You, and then you. Probably not correct, but a little risky. Who cares? Let's go for it. Surely I'll get a magic mushroom, right? Oh, oh my! And it was never real. <laughs> okay. 
Death should be a lot easier for us. Death too, no problem. We should be able to follow Star Bethlehem. And there's a secret room. I want to go in this direction first. We're just going to clear this out really quickly and then we'll follow the star. Boom. Crane game? I know I'm going to waste all of my money here and I don't care. Always gamble, really. Spider mod's worth it. Golden Teleport 2.0. Yes, absolutely. Get me out of this delirium. What? I'm I'm losing all my money. Please. And now hopefully I get the Eternal D6 in like one try. Thank you. That's more like it. And then take this. Take this. Roll moment. Ludo. Oh, yikes. No, no, no. I'll do this though. Don't take Ludo by accident, please. Treasure. Yeah. Mm, you just you see like I don't really know how I feel about that. I will roll it. I will get a way better item. Hey, here's Star of Bethlehem. I haven't seen you all game, dude. I've just been seeing you inside the boss rooms. You're going too fast for me. We can actually take both of these. May as well. What's in here? Guppy Tail. That's worth. I mean, just like without, beyond a shadow of a doubt. I'll take this and then buy. I don't know how much I want to commit to like the whole uh, teleport 2.0 thing. Because this is a scary run. I'm four hits away from death. I'm gonna wait for this to go in here. We should nuke the boss. It's a flight item? Uh, probably just gonna roll it. HP. Yeah. That is the most terrifying enemy I've seen in my life. Holy. Seeing that guy slowly turn around and aim directly at me, I- I- I, uh... My heart sank. This is the incorrect way to do this room. Never do it that way. Always stay up there. I'm a bozo. Oh, I kind of want to do that. Ooh, I kind of want to do this. Yera, I take Yera with me. Oh, that's a Krampus fight. Well, I either get Lump of Coal and I get happy, or I re-roll into Brimstone and I get even happier. There's two outcomes here, and it looks like it's the first one. Let's take you, use you. Epic. Wow, what is this room? Okay, sick. I mean, I have infinite money. Eden Soul. I kind of, eh. it's definitely rigging, but I just don't feel the rig today. You know what I mean? Like, I, I don't, I don't think this is a rig day. I think I go with the Error Rooms Teleport 2.0 and I go for just normal rerolls from Eternal D6. That's good. We give that to you. That's also good. And it's almost fun. So sure. Chaos Bull. Yeah, if you didn't know, if you get items in the Error Room, it's always chaos. It could be anything. Talk to friends. Time to waste $700 all over again. Just because I want an item that doesn't even matter to me. Never mind, I'm lucky today. Do you what? I don't know how I feel about that. I don't know how I feel about taking that item, actually. Also, sitting at 14 base damage just by pure money is kind of goaded. I'm not going to risk that. Am I an anime enjoyer? I don't watch anime, but I have an appreciation for anime and its art form. I think it's super cool and I think the culture behind it is sick, but if you were to tell me, do you watch anime? I would tell you, no, I don't. My favorite anime is Dragon Ball and that's basically all I've ever watched. So that's like my level, you know what I mean? Like I like, I like Goku. <laughs> Goku's cool. Oh, hi, luck. You need luck because you have Apple and you have all the damage in the world. There's my Star of Bethlehem. Once again, just kind of gaming. I'm gonna break my way through here Minecraft style and just touch the buttons. Ooh, hello! Money, money. Uh, it's kind of hard to use Star of Bethlehem on the Illiz fight because she's like directly on top of it, but I can try. There you go. We got a deal! It's nothing! Should I take it? Yeah, of course. Why not? Excuse me? This was so worth it. This turned out to be a really nuts so run. I definitely had to min-max and try for it, but that's also kind of the fun of it, you know? Jacob and Esau is not just a free win. Oh, re-roll everything. You really gotta try. I feel like I accomplished, you know? I'm, I'm sitting at 334 money moment. Triple nickel moment. Holy moly. I will now spawn an item. It's four little horns, actually. Who guessed that one? Who, who guessed it? Esau got hit by little horn. I'm forever shamed. The moment I touched that button, who in their, who in their, like, mind was like, Oh, you know what? He's gonna touch the button, and it's gonna be Little Horn. I'm not, you know, mm, I'm just gonna go. Shoal's getting a bit too scary for me. And I know my error room, or my Star Bethlehem went this way, so I know it's the boss's this direction. Bro was so slow. Look at my tier rate. What is this? Uh, I will go here just because my secret room is only one room off. 
that's worth it. But the rest I'm just gonna go. Later. Well, thanks to Star Bethlehem making it so I could skip the entirety of Shoal. And says it's good to know. Hey, we can see our dark room. Three and four. Kind of missed time, but that's okay. If I stand in front of Star Bethlehem, I should be nice and good. Ow. We're good. Okay, Yara, don't forget because I always do. And says don't forget because I always do. What am I going to get? Boom. Sure. Nah. I'll kind of mid. Ooh, I like that. Pound of Flesh is whatever. That's kind of good. That's also Leviathan, technically. That is a god item. I could go for the big risk play, or I could just go fight the boss. <laughs> Ooh, ah, yikes. I don't know, dude. Let's go down one room because one room equals uh, uh, two secret rooms, and that's definitely worth it. I'm a little on edge here. I mean, this is not supposed to be easy, right? I gotta go beat Mega Satan. This is whatever. This is whatever. Do I have Leviathan here? No, I don't, do I? This is probably wrong, but... Oh my god, everything rerolled perfectly and I got chocolate milk? Wait, that was so worth it. <laughs> what? This is spun? Okay. I gave it to the wrong person. Should I just go? I might be able to beat him. Oh! That will not happen. What I will do though is I'll take this. And then I'll just go. Oh, this is tough. This is hard. This is hard. This is gonna be a hard fight. I actually have to focus. There is no cheese. There's no I'm OP. I just gotta go. I have a 20 tier rate high damage build, but at any point I could die. Star Bethlehem's gonna carry me. Just try our best. Nice. Mini boss fight's gonna be the hardest. Careful. Nice. Pride couldn't do anything. Listen for the sound cue for Mega Blast. Angel's done for. I think we're good. The damage is crazy good. It's more like if he does- oh, there's Mega Blast. If he does a bullet pattern, I can't really dodge, you know? It's mainly Mega uh, Satan 2 that's gonna be tough here. Because Mega Satan 2 does bullet patterns only, and I kind of have a double hitbox moment going on. Yeah, like here. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna group up a little bit and just hope that I'm good to go. What is this? Okay, this one's easy. Thank God he gave me a little bit of mercy. Go back into the Star of Bethlehem. And then one more phase. No, he's just he's just gonna AFK and give me the win. <laughs> nah, I don't care. I just want Mega Blast. Let's go. It should this should be the unlock. Illusion baby. And yes!